What's going on, Print Fam? Today we are talking about the Easy Post integration to allow you to create shipping labels from within the Print Life uh, software. So here we are um, in the Print Life dashboard. We're going to come down here to settings. We're going to scroll down to shipping and we're going to go to Easy Post. Uh, first thing we're going to do is just check the Enable Easy Post tab right here. Uh, and then what we're going to do is we're going to go to our Easy Post dashboard. So if you haven't created an account, go to easypost.com. You're going to sign up, create the account, and get logged in. Uh, once you're logged in, you're going to be greeted. In most cases, you'll be on the analytics dashboard, which will have nothing going on. What you want to do is come all the way down here on the left menu to account settings. Uh, first thing you need to do without a shadow of a doubt is you need to connect a billing account which is either going to be your business credit card your bank your personal bank account your personal checking account whatever you need to add a payment method and then you're going to need to add funds to the wallet you also need to set up wallet settings for when it's going to re uh, re up those funds like if it goes below a certain amount then it will pull another certain amount out of your account this has to be set up uh, along with, I don't know if you need to connect your carriers to do this, but yeah, you're going to need to at least connect one carrier, whether it's UPS, FedEx, or USPS. Uh, you need to set, make sure that you as a member are in here, and you need to set up a sender's address, which I don't actually have in here right now. But you need to add uh, the address that you're shipping from, your business address, your home address, whatever. You need to add that. Only when you have all this stuff set up will you have access to your API key tab. Now, if you've gone through and set all of these things up and you still don't have this API key tab, I can't help you with this. You need to reach out to Easy Post. Come down here to the help center or call them or whatever you got to do to submit a ticket you have to get in touch with them uh, as to why you're not getting this API key once you got have gotten all that sorted out what you want to do is copy the production API key not the test API key even if you're just trying to use our software to run a test shipment you cannot use the test API key. It will not work ever, even under testing circumstances. Pretend this one does not exist. No test API key. I can't say this enough because I've had thousands of you call saying Easy Post isn't working, and then I come to find out that you've pasted this API key in there. This doesn't exist. Okay. I love you guys. Copy the production API key. Once you have access to it, and it may take a little a second for Easy Post to approve you for it, copy the API key, come over to the dashboard, go to settings, scroll down to shipping, go to Easy Post, check enable. You're going to paste Control V or with Mac, I don't know, the API key in here. You can look at it to make sure that it's the correct one. I'm not going to do it because for obvious reasons. You're going to hit save. And Easy Post is connected. You will now have shipping options on checkout. You'll be able to generate shipping labels uh, from the production dashboard right, right here. You'll be able to create labels. You'll be able to put your box width, length, height, weight in. You know, you're going to be able to add as many of those as you want and all that good stuff. So just get verified with the Easy Post account and you'll be off to the races, guys. That's it. You're the best. We'll talk to you later.